<laughs> little toast. <laughs> yeah, exactly, a little toast. There you go, a little rough toast. So it, it's going to be that kind of weekend, that's for sure. As we get a look at LAX this evening, you will see the pylons lit up purple. Just beautiful purple. And we're looking at a little more sunshine, or we were earlier today. We did get a little bit of cloud cover, but warmer conditions all around. And then that was that. We got cloudy and cool, but again, a little warmer than where we've been. Tomorrow, more clouds. Cooler weather, rain on the way this weekend, increasing rain potentially Saturday night and then the heaviest rain Sunday night into Monday so I want to time it all out for you in just a moment here you will see rain to our north rain to our west and as we get a look at your future cast right here you will see widespread showers coming to the mix as we head to Saturday afternoon and Saturday evening pretty much everybody could see a chance of a raindrop nothing too heavy though Saturday night it does get a little heavier by Sunday it lightens up a little bit by Sunday late morning much drier and Sunday is a relatively dry day with the exception of a few showers here and there. It's Sunday night where things start to pick up and it's Monday morning where the rain really starts to intensify for us a little bit. Take a look right here, widespread rain around your morning commute right before we get to work, school, so plan accordingly as we head into Monday of next week. It does get a little drier later in the day and it starts to dry out more so by Tuesday, even drier by Wednesday and Thursday. But again, the big rain days will be Sunday and Monday, mainly Sunday night, Monday morning and Monday afternoon. We could get one to even two, even possibly isolated amounts, up to three inches expected. Snow at 7,500 feet. So not a big snowmaker, but certainly a significant rainmaker. Pat, Chauncey, back to you. Enjoy.